my dear, it's Cora here. We are so far right now. And now finally we will find your color palette. And the easiest way is to choose one of your signature images you have collected in your Pinterest board. So what you see here on my screen is of course Pinterest. And I have um, searched for color palettes. And what you see here is exactly what the magic of picking colors from a picture means. Every color palette here has a reference and the reference is the picture. And this is what we will do today as well. So let's see, I am collecting pictures. I have put in the search word leaves and this picture for example I had recently used for one of my clients Rachel mood board and I will save this now to my computer by clicking the right mouse cl click and save it to a folder on my computer And here it is on my computer. Okay, so very quickly, I will show you again to integrate this into coolers. Here is the website. Click on get started. It's free. Click on the icon with a camera, drag and drop. Put your picture in this field. Let Coolers do the magic. And additional to the information I have shared with you in the previous video, here are some other tricks how to generate colors from this picture. So you could click Auto and it will choose automatically colors from the image. And you can do this over and over and over again. This, for example, is an autumn infused color palette. This one is autumn and winter combined. Autumn as well. And here is going even brighter. And we will do this as long as we wish. Let's see if I find something. I like this color palette and I say, of course you can click on this picture, for example, and say, okay, where's the circle here? I want to change this. I like a brighter orange in this direction or this green is hmm, not that bad, but not exactly what I was looking for. I am looking for a brighter turquoise and to match the other colors and then i say okay what we have here is the range of colors from this image and you could grab one of these stripes and rearrange the color palette if you wish as well you could say okay this is still not as i like it i like it even brighter or more contrast, more in the direction of a winter infused color palette. I like it very strong. The same here, it is a bit muted and I like more contrast, give it a, a more contrast. And here I like, like to stand out even, but more saturation and a little bit darker. So. Okay, so here are the different versions of the color in RGB, which is the screen version of colors. So every color on your screen, on your computer, in the internet has the key in red, green and blue. And this is how it comes together. So you could 
um, you could save this code if you want. And if you want to print, to have, you want to have the colors to print um, your documents, this is the color for print. It's cyan, magenta, yellow, and K for black. And you could even save this color information here for only for this color here. If uh, you think, oh, that's beautiful enough, you can go to export and export it as a PNG. But if you think, okay, I'd like to do some more adjustments, you could say in, I go in this direction and want more uh, spring infused color palette. It's more light or I want to change differently completely. You can try this or if you want to have it more brighter. This is also spring. And when it's more muted, then it is going in the direction of summer. And yeah, you can, you can change some things here. Okay. Um, I feel like this is a little bit too strong. Okay. And then go to export as a PNG. Here we are. And with a right mouse click, say save image as and put it into your color palette folder. If you want to have it open in a separate document, you could say, I want to adjust this very quickly. I want it to come back. Where is it? If you want to adjust it, you can say, Oh yeah, it's not opening in a different tab, but that's okay. So here is the hex code. You can have it in front of you exactly in the color palette and then go and use it. Next step is to open your board. And you say, save a pin from your computer. You can do this. Choose a photo. And I have saved a lot of pictures. To find it. And say, opening it search for the board here it is and say safe sometimes it takes a little bit time go to reload and then it should show up here wonderful yeah, that's it for today. I can't wait to see all your beautiful color palettes. Please share in the Facebook group, put it in into your mood board here on Pinterest. And what would be beneficial is if you like, share not only your pa color palette, but also the signature image you picked the colors from. Okay, so that's it for today. Tomorrow is very, very juicy. We are starting to create your mood board um, so perhaps i can share a little secret here this is the whole material i've created for you guys and wow 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 these are the mood boards i have created for you for example this one here and yours will show up the same way because you can put in your pictures in here. So you will need one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight signature pictures and one typographical expression of your style. So this is a sneak peek for tomorrow and I am looking forward to see what you are creating today.
Thank you and share in the Facebook group. Looking forward. Bye.